Meta CEO Mark Zuckerberg admits the Biden White House pressured Facebook and Instagram to censor information going to their users. He writes this, in 2021, senior officials from the Biden administration, including the White House, repeatedly pressured our teams for months to censor certain COVID-19 content, including humor and satire, and expressed a lot of frustration with our teams when we didn't agree. I believe the government pressure was wrong, and I regret that we were not more outspoken about it. Pete Hegseth and Jason Chaffetz are here, but first to Fox Business correspondent Hillary Vaughn. Hi, Hillary. Hi, Martha. Well, Mark Zuckerberg clearly had a come-to-Jesus moment where he realized he needed to come out and confess that the Biden-Harris administration did strong-arm their platform to try to suppress and censor content. In a letter to Congress, Zuckerberg saying he regrets that they let it happen, saying, quote, I also think we made some choices that, with the benefit of hindsight and new information, we wouldn't make today. But the Biden-Harris White House, in hindsight, doesn't think they did anything wrong, and they have no regrets. A White House spokesperson saying in reaction to Zuckerberg's apology letter, quote, our position has been clear and consistent. We believe tech companies and other private actors should take into account the effects their actions have on the American people while making independent choices about the information they present. But Republicans think the Biden-Harris engagement with social media sites went beyond just trying to make sure they were acting responsibly. Some House Republicans want officials responsible. Typical government response. A bunch of bullshit. 